Members, we've heard many great resolutions today against atrocities, against genocide. Let me just read this to you real quickly about this amendment. On April 25, 1999, 10,000 practitioners of Falun Gong gathered peacefully near the government offices in Beijing, asking that the law reaffirm their right to practice Falun Gong. They quietly waited for hours, and while some of the people met with the government officials, it was the most peaceful demonstration of its size in modern Chinese history. Falun Gong was banned two months, two months later on July 20th, 1999, and, brutal, and a brutal crackdown began that has lasted 18 years, taking many innocent lives and continues to this day. Right here in this room, you'll see them sitting peacefully once again above us in the gallery, waiting to be recognized by their state legislature. They are all immigrants, and they have all come to the U.S. by way of asylum to escape persecution in China. We are their legislature. We are their voices. We are their representatives. Please do not deny them the right to be heard. Let's let may us be clear that they chose the right country to seek asylum in. Members, I ask that you not table this motion, this amendment, excuse me, not motion, amendment, and that you allow it to come to the floor so that they may hear loudly and clearly that we do not stand by the practices of genocide or harvesting body parts for sale. We do not condone uh, atrocities against man. We stand united to recognize all faiths and all religions of the world and that they have a right to practice here in the United States, but more importantly, in a diverse state like California. Let's make sure that this marginalized community has when they leave this room, the knowledge that they did the right thing because we did the right thing by them. Thank you.